Hey, what's going on, guys? Your boy Scott here. I'm be showing you little bits and pieces on how I've earned my uh, gems in um, what you call Pet Simulator 99. As you can see, I'm rocking the Jesus head, fresh cut, looking pretty cool. Not that close. Anyway, um, supercomputer wise, um, huge wise, pet wise, you're gonna want to sell a whole bunch of things. Now, that might sound like a horrible thing to do, but if you have an inventory, and it's like mine where it's all jammed up with stuff. You don't want to get rid of some items. Like you don't want to just hold on to everything and wait till the last second. Just sell everything. Sell everything that you don't need. That you don't need. Not that you do need. Because that would make no sense at all. Like the gift bags, the bundles. Um, I would say just sell them. The gift bag. You get normal stuff out of them, but for me, like potions, um, items, what I normally go after here, that's what I normally sell. Enchantments, you know, they give me like a thousand books. It's really cool and all, but like, who's ever gonna buy like half, you know, all these books at once? I mean, not at once, but like, who's gonna book on them if they don't need these kind of books to be, uh, the basics and stuff like that and I'm uh, just trying to make a sale um, you know I don't even know what I'm saying maybe I could tell them make a little bit of a profit but maybe I could make a little bit of a profit but right now I'm wearing huge hunter super magnet and party time it's been working out pretty well I do have auto farm and I do have auto tap I have huge hunter ultra lucky VIP and super drops as well as an ultimate finisher nightmare exclusive one of my favorite you know I haven't messed around with all the other ones because I've been told this one's the best one to use because it drops like a, um, a loot that could be sold for the nightmare fuel it's called and you can sell it for like almost 600 to 700,000 gems and I've got it a few times actually and it worked really well a lot of people want to buy that for some reason <laughs> I don't know so let's head on over to the best area in the game. Best area in the game is pretty much occupied by uh, a lot of people. Um, you're always going to find things over here. Is that guy a piece of bread? With butter? Ah, that's a, that's a pet. Oh wow. Is it just sitting on top of them? That's cool. That's one of the coolest ones I've seen. Wow, cool man. Um, let's just go to a little area over here. I don't, I don't wanna pop on my surfboard. Now, if you get in areas like this, you wanna get these pets. I can just put these farms on them, like royalty, you know, mid range. And all that kind of stuff. Don't get a hold of a hell lot easier to get uh, silver. Not silver, um, yeah, what am I saying? <laughs> yeah, um, just an example, just an example. What you really want to do is you want to go over here and try and unlock all the people. Stick around. Auto axe, AFK. Oh, yeah, I don't know if I said it earlier, but uh, if you're in a clan, like in my clan, they will require you to go to this thing over here and make it to at least the fifth level and then quit. So you want to help out your clan, you'd always do stuff like this. Let's go back to that voice. 
don't know if I mentioned this earlier, but I probably did mention it. You know, I, I could probably watch the video back and watch, rewatch it, edit it. But um, pets equipped. It. Make sure you have all of them. Make sure you have all your eggs and all that kind of stuff. All right. Thank you for watching the video. This is my guide. If you enjoy it, please let me know. Thank you.